in just the last few minutes. They moved out some of those cars and you can get a better shot of where that derailment actually happened down there. That sent four people to the hospital earlier. Two of those were airlifted to Georgia Regents University. Their conditions are unknown at this time. Two people were sent to a local hospital here in Sandersville. Now, both of those trains were Norfolk Southern trains. One of the trains was coming out of Atlanta, headed to Savannah, and the other one was a local industrial train that was carrying wood chips and scrap metal. Now, there are a total of three derailed locomotives and three derailed cars. There is no hazmat situation at this point, but there is a diesel fuel leak where that collision happened that may be causing a little trouble. Uh, crews are trying to assess that situation right now and trying to see what they can do as far as cleanup and getting these trains re-railed and moved out. Right now, I'm live in Sandersville. Nicole Snyder for WJBF News Channel 6.